right, hey guys, Justin here with another quick update for you, this time about our new HRV that we got unboxed. This thing here, what is an HRV? Stands for Heat Recovery Ventilator. So if you're, uh, you know, we're trying to have the house pretty airtight, so there's not gonna be a lot of natural air exchange going back and forth. So this is basically just a means of mechanical ventilation. It's uh, rated for about 100 CFM. Uh, since this is a small house, that's really all we need. So that's the ventilator, the V in the HRV. Heat recovery means that uh, if there's a difference in the outside air temperature and the inside air temperature, it's meant to recover some of that uh, either way. So let's say you have your house cool inside and it's hot outside. Well, if you're bringing a bunch of air in, you don't want to make this one get too hot because that would disturb his nap, as you can see. And so uh, it exchanges a little bit of the energy either way. So. So we can essentially actually just sort of run it all day, uh, all night. It's always kind of bringing in fresh air and keeping, uh, you know, keeping anything inside, moving that out, uh, and then um, bringing the fresh air in, but doing it in a way where we recover the heat and also can uh, filter it as well. So let's go in for a closer look and I'll show you how the machine works. Okay, here we are taking a closer look inside the machine. So imagine you're some stale air inside, maybe came from, I don't know, let's say the bathroom. So we'll collect, a, we'll collect the air from different points, but uh, more details on that once we install the ducting. But anyway, the stale air from the building comes in this side, and then it goes up this way across this kind of heater core, I guess you could call it, and then it will get exhausted out this port to the outside. Now, that is kind of the whole exhaust side of things. On the fresh air side, fresh air comes in this top port, comes down this way, goes through a filter, goes across the same heater core, goes through a couple more filters, including this one, which is a HEPA filter, which is nice because this machine basically has an integrated HEPA filter, which uh, in the summertime, if it's smoky or something like that, it would be good to filter out all those particles. And then, that air comes along here and goes out this port as a uh, supply to the building. So the heat recovery part really happens in this yellow thing. Essentially that difference in air temperature I was just describing gets, the heat gets exchanged across that. So if there was uh, cool air on the inside, then that would, heat would be somewhat transferred to uh, the, or the, I guess the heat would actually be transferred from the outside air into the cooler air coming across it. So that's what makes it heat recovery. Otherwise its main job is really just ventilation. The other component of this whole system, other than some ducts that we gotta buy, we decided to get this concentric vent kit. So this thing is where it's gonna go through the exterior wall. Uh, essentially it's pretty simple, just um, you know, one of the, one side of the supply from inside is one half of it. The exhaust outside is the other half and it gets combined into a single center tube. So there's just a single uh, penetration through the exterior wall. This side of it, round part of it, will connect to this exterior thing. So this is what we'll see outside. Essentially, uh, the exhaust will get blown out the top and the intake will come in one side or the other. I'm actually not sure which side is which, but essentially that's how it works. It just uh, makes it a little simpler as it goes through the wall. So that is, the unboxing and the whole machine we gotta like a lot of things buy a few more parts before we can get it installed but that's the update from today